morning, welcome. It's a try on haul. I know a lot of you love the try on hauls, so here I am with one for you. Today's try on haul is from a brand called Flory Day. It is very kindly gifted. The video is not sponsored or paid, but they did gift the clothing, just to be clear on that at the outset. And for new viewers who haven't watched my channel before, who have just arrived here from elsewhere, welcome. Thank you for joining me. And I always say at the beginning of these videos that I am five foot three. Sorry, I just wanted to angle you down a little bit. I'm five foot three, so on the short side, and I am a size 18-ish on the bottom and 22-ish on the top, 2022 on the top. So Flurry Day contacted me and I looked at their website, they had lots of things that I was interested in that looked rather nice and I ordered from them. It did take a while to dispatch I should say um, but once it dispatched it was here within less than a week so that was good. Um, and I have to say the clothes look nice. Um, the thing I am slight, I haven't tried anything on yet. I've taken it all out of its packets and hung it for a couple of days just to get rid of some of the creases, although some of it is a little bit creased. Um, and the sizing was a bit of an issue in terms of I've recently lost weight and haven't really caught up with what size I am now. <laughs> so that's quite difficult. I'm still inside my head, perhaps a little bit bigger than I, I haven't lost loads of weight, but you know, I'm perhaps in my head a little bit bigger than I actually am. And the sizing, the sizing on the website doesn't correlate to UK sizing at all. It's all measurements in inches and centimeters and I did measure myself, uh, but it's still difficult, you know, so I feel like some of what I've bought is going to be very big. Having said that, I might try it on and it's not at all, who knows. But without further ado, let's get into it. I haven't got exact prices for you here, but I can tell you that the, ch the six items, um, two tops and four dresses, I think, and the cheapest item was £19, the most expensive item was about £30, and most of them sort of fell into the early 20s category, pounds-wise. I'll obviously put all the links to the items below. And all that having been said, let's get on with it. So this is the first item. I love pale blue. I feel like it's such a almost universally flattering colour. It's an oversized shirt and in the picture, I'll put the um, pictures from the website up here obviously for you to look at as well. Um, I loved the tie, the way the model had it tied at the front. I thought that was a really nice look. I'm not sure I'd wear it with little short shorts but I thought with um, perhaps leggings or something um, or capri pants in the summer. Um, very nice it does look hugely oversized i have to say i ordered this in a 3x um yeah it does look very very big but that's not necessarily a bad thing with a blouse um the fabric is quite nice it's got a slight sheen um it's, it's all man-made fabric so i'm sure i'm guessing this is viscose or polyester or a blend of the two i like the fabric i like the style let's put it on and see what it's like rather like this one it's, um, I've rolled back the sleeves a little bit. They're a little bit on the long side, although they have got cuff buttons, so they do up. Um, and I've tied the front. I, I think that, it, although it is very big, it is quite a nice oversized fit. I feel like it looks quite good in terms of um, the fit. And it's quite long at the back, which I quite like. Covers up my bum, but isn't too long in terms of my height. So yeah, I really like this. I can see myself popping this on as a very sort of nice casual, I can see it over a pair of jeans as well, crop jeans in the summertime and springtime. I think it's gonna be a really versatile, well-used piece of clothing in my wardrobe, very much like this. Next, I ordered this top, sort of colour block top. Again, quite a loose fit. I ordered this, oh, th this one is in a 2XL. I think I felt this one was quite oversized, so I ordered down in that one and it's just plain blue on the back turquoisey blue it's a jersey fabric it looked a little more like linen I thought like a loose wit sort of cottony linen um, in the picture but I still quite like it I like the neckline as well it's a V but sort of a curved V which I thought was quite nice I like a V neck for um again elongating me in terms of my height so let's try this Two out of two. I quite like this one as well. I really do like the neckline. I feel like it's quite flattering. It shows a little bit more 
of my shoulders because it's a little bit wider but without showing too much of my bra straight you can just about see one there actually but it's not one of those that you're going to have to be constantly hoiking up because of bra straps I like the colour block design I think the size is good um, I like, love the three quarter sleeves you know I love a three quarter sleeve um, it's a nice length covers my bum um, it's yeah perfect size it's I, I feel like it's the perfect size for me in terms of how I feel comfortable you know which is the most important thing isn't it when we're choosing things to wear that make us feel good um again I really like the colors as well the next four the final four the rest of the haul is dresses and some of the pictures I've put in a lot of these things come in several different colors so I'm going to put the pictures in from the website in an alternative color to what I'm showing you here just to show you some of the other things they've got but this is a double layer dress this comes off completely so you can wear it with or without which is quite nice but I loved the I felt like this could be dressed up with a pair of heels and a nice handbag um, or down with sort of a straw bag and flat sandals, espadrilles, something like that. Um, and it could be a daytime or an evening dress. I felt like this was really flexible. I say it a lot, but nice dress for on holiday. <laughs> love the colours again, the blue, and I love polka dots, as you know. I'm slightly concerned it might be a little long, but size-wise, it looks all right. We're sticking with doing the ones that look all right size-wise first. You noticed I'm not quite brave enough to go to the ones that don't look great in terms of size. Right, let's pop it on. Not entirely sure how I'm feeling about this one. Um, I feel like this over bit cuts me off at my widest bit and therefore isn't the most flattering side note this dress has pockets that was a bonus i didn't realize that at all when i ordered it but that's very nice um so yeah i feel like that's possibly not the most flattering on me i do like the style um but yeah it just it feels as though it's really bulking me out around here um, perhaps you need to be a very very stick thin thin person to cover carry this off um, I don't know, I don't know how I feel about it, but yeah, I don't think it looks great on the back either, although it's got a little bit of a dip on the back there, the fabric. Um, not sure, let me know your thoughts on this one. It's, it is cotton, by the way, this one, which is very nice and cool for summer. Um, and I love the floatiness, the swishiness of it. Let's have a look at it without the extra top on. I'm not a fan of myself in anything sleeveless at all. Um, don't like my upper arms very much, but I guess that could be said of most of us when we get to this age, really, or a lot of us anyway, I don't want to generalise. Um, that, I think, looks better. I feel like that looks, l somehow, just this seam, which is slightly higher up, sort of waist level on me, which get, it goes in a little bit, I feel like that looks so much better, like that. Okay, let's look at this one next. In the pic, I think this must have been on a six foot model and I stupidly thought I could carry off something that looked good on a six foot model. It looked sort of very nice and drapey and skimmy and it just looks like a bit of an old sack shape here. It also looks extremely long. Um, and I do love the pattern, I love the print, I love the layered effect at the bottom with the second layer of fabric. Um, I like the v-neck and I like the buttons on the front and I like the half sleeve so those are all positives I just feel like it might be going to swamp me a little bit but nothing ventured nothing gained let's try it on and see I've just realized I haven't told you sizing for the last two the blue dress was a double double XL and this also is a double XL this actually doesn't look as bad now I've got it on I actually quite like it I have got a belt I'm gonna see what it looks like with a belt I feel like it's not nearly as swamping as I thought it might be. Um, it is very loose fit, it is that sort of larg and looky, you know, um, <laughs> it could almost be a dressing gown, couldn't it? I can hear my mother inside my head saying, you look like you've got your dressing gown on. Um, if you're watching, Mum, let me know if you think it looks like a dressing gown. <laughs> but I actually quite like this, I feel, yeah, it's much better than I thought it would be. Anyway, let me try it. Oh, sorry, I'll just do you all the way around. I don't think it's very interesting to see from the back in this. 
but I feel quite nice in it. I feel like it skims quite nicely and I really like the double layer of the skirt at the bottom. Um, I would have to wear heels with this. I've got about a three inch wedge on here and I couldn't wear anything much shorter than that in terms of it hitting the ground. I couldn't wear them with, a, with this with a flat shoe. Right, let me put the belt on and I'll come back again. Oh, I am liking this. I'm not usually a fan of myself with a belt around the middle. I'm very high waisted, but I actually think that looks all right. Not this particular belt, maybe. It, it hasn't got an extra thing in there, so it's hanging down. But I actually feel like with some messing about a little bit, this dress could look quite nice. I feel like maybe with a wider waist belt, you know, maybe one of those elasticated ones. I don't know, what do you think? I feel, oh, I feel like I haven't done it quite right at the back now. It's all a bit rucked up at the back. But yeah, I, I, this is so much better than I thought it would be, this dress. I really do like it quite a lot. What a surprise, so it just goes to show we can't judge books by covers, can we? We ought to be more open-minded because on a rail in a shop, I definitely wouldn't have picked that out, although I did pick it out from the website, obviously. Right, two more to go. I think one's gonna be a hit and one's gonna be a miss. Shall we go with the miss first? Let's do that. This, when I looked at this on the website, we're going away for our silver wedding anniversary for a two night break to a hotel near Bath that looks very, very lovely. It's gonna be a very special break. Um, and I was hoping for a dress that might be suitable for that, for one evening there. Um, in the picture, this looked elegant and classy and as though it would cover up um, my stomach quite nicely. In reality, it looks like Billy Smart's bloody circus tent with some sort of weird thing attached to it. <laughs> no offence. Um, I'm really hoping that this is going to look nicer on me than it does off me to me <laughs> yeah let's try it on and see looks quite nice on the model in my defense doesn't it again i shouldn't be judging that book by its cover i actually quite like this i think it's very flattering not sure if it's a little bit old fuddy duddy for me particularly in this color but i actually quite like the color it was my school uniform color and usually i don't like it but um I, th I quite like it. <laughs> yeah, I I'm not sure about this. I think I might have to lose the brooch. But, and I also feel like it's a bit... No, I actually... No, let me be honest. I like myself in this. I feel quite confident. I feel like... I, I like the underlayer because it's quite straight. And it sits below my knee perfectly for me. Um, not quite far as far down as mid-calf. Um, the angle you're sorry I always need to say at this point the angle you're seeing because I've tipped you down to get my whole body and you can't actually you're not seeing me straight on so you can't see where it hangs to easily um, I like the overlayer I like this so much that I am going to go down to the garage Ashley's in the garage and show him this dress and I never ever show him anything I'm wearing because his interest level is like basically less than zero let's be honest but I like myself in this. I, the only thing is, would it feel a little old? But no, I pretty much like it. I know you're all dying to know what Ashley said. He said, nice, I like it. Then he said, not sure about the rosette thing, which I agree with him on that. And then he said, have you seen the recycling box? I can't find it. So I'm guessing that was the end of his judgment of my clothing. I've saved my favourite off the hanger until last, and it is this one. This comes in a variety of colours. I thought this looked perfect for summer wedding guest, summer party, that sort of thing. Um, it's a little bit creased. I got it in a 3XL, I think because it was a slightly straighter style, I decided to go up because I don't want anything clingy. I am not a girl who likes clingy clothing, but I'm excited to try this one on. Oh my God, I love this. Look at how lovely it is. Really, really like that. The neckline isn't sitting quite right. Um, camera battery died, so we had to restart. Um, or not restart, but change the battery. I absolutely love this dress. I feel so nice in this. Um, 
The armholes are a little gaping and I've got black underwear on which was suitable for the majority of the clothing and hence I went with black, obviously not with this one. So yeah, the armholes were a little bit gapy so I wouldn't want to wear it without some sort of camisole underneath or the top chiffon layer on. But I love this, I feel really nice in this. Um, I can't wait to wear it, I really can't feel like I originally had this comes in lots of different colors I originally had the green in my bag but I'm so glad I changed it for this purpley color although I expect it's lovely and green as well and the turquoise look nice as well very very happy with this one well overall that was a pretty good haul wasn't it I feel like as I said it's always so hit and miss with sizing with when it doesn't correlate to normal sizes and although I did measure myself and compare with their size guide I feel like I've done not too badly in terms of the sizing um at least three quarters of it I would in fact there's nothing that I wouldn't wear I'd even wear the blue spotty dress which was probably I felt was the least flattering on me um yeah I think I'd wear every single item and it's not often I can say that with a haul, is it? As I said, I'll put all the links below. Let me know in the comments which you liked, which you didn't like. Um, feel free to be constructive in your comments, but not bloody rude. We don't have bloody rudeness on this channel. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Um,